Welcome back everybody and today it's an unboxing for the month of May and it's the Evil Enabler products for the month of May obviously as I said before for Auntie Vera's Scrap and Craft. We are participating in the National Scrapbooking Day and so these are some of the products I chose for May. The first products I chose was some gorgeous embossing powder. The first colour I chose is this gorgeous green, it's called Sage and then I picked this lovely red colour and it's called Love Letters and they're both from Rangers. My next product is a stencil from Do Dilusions and it's called Love Heart Small. I absolutely love this stencil, I cannot wait to use it. Next up were these gorgeous oh, stickers, they're very colourful. I cannot wait to use them. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them yet, but I'm sure I'll find a project. Look at them, aren't they gorgeous colours? Very colourful. And here will come the ephemera pack that I'll be using for my first layout. It's from Crate Paper and it's the Wild Heart Collection. And the papers I picked are also all from Crate Paper. And they're also all from the Wild Heart Collection. So. I am looking forward to matching all these ephemera pieces with the gorgeous Wild Heart collection papers that I picked. And that is also part of my challenge because me and ephemera don't really play nicely. Next is the Wild at Heart from Crepe Paper, the gorgeous stamp set. And I do actually use this in my very first layout, so wait and see what I do with it. And then these gorgeous little... Oh, what are they? Little, little dangly charms. I don't know, for lack of a better word. They're from um, oh, Good Vibes. Not sure what I'll do with them, but I'm sure I'll find something for them. Aren't they gorgeous? I love the colours. So, Auntie Vera, thanks for picking those charms for me. And next, Auntie Vera also picked for me these gorgeous... Oh, I'm not sure what they call. They're from Kaiser Craft and they're, oh, they call them curios. Anyway, they're sort of glass circles. And even though they're from a different collection to my world at heart, I think they'll go really nicely together. And I love mixing different collections from different sections. As you know, as long as the colours match and everything, it'll still work beautifully. And the papers I picked were, are all from Crepe Paper. They are from the Wild at Wild Heart collection. So this gorgeous brown one and on the other side is these beautiful leaves, sort of palm leaves I guess they are. That is called Paradise. And this other gorgeous one, I love those black and white triangles. And that is called Retreat. So can't wait to use that and it's got more pines on the other side. And this gorgeous yellow one is called Hustle. And look at the other side, sort of pinks and blues and black palms I love it and oh look at all those gorgeous little are they tigers or leopards I think I'm going to go with leopards and that paper is called now let me tell you with the lovely polka dots on the other side it's called raw isn't that gorgeous and this paper I got two of because I liked both sides so this is called planted Appropriate name, I guess. Who comes up with all these paper names? I'd love to know. And this other paper I also got two of because I liked both sides. And when I like both sides, I know that I'm going to find it hard to pick one or the other. And that is called Days. I absolutely love the sunglasses. Let's see what I do with this one. Oh, and here we are. Of these ones here, I also used them in my first layout, which you will see very shortly. And Mental Blank, I can't remember what they're called. This paper is called Palms. There you go. And this gorgeous, very colourful one on one side and pink and yellow on the other is called Jungle. So that is it for me. And I hope you like my unboxing. Remember, the all products that I just showed are all from Auntie Vera Scrap and Craft. So show her some love, jump onto her website, and I'm sure you'll find lots of goodies to indulge yourself with. And don't re and remember, all of us 
deserve to indulge ourselves.